Hey guys, Robert with r, r Environmental. What if you have a well and groundwater seeping in and you can't keep up with it and you have no vacuum? Here you have the well, you have the groundwater that's seeping in, you have a cage or some sort of catch and our absorbent. We're gonna put our absorbent into the catch this could be a cylinder, this could be any type of vehicle for you to lower the absorbent into the water. This is a little too perforated and a little too permeable, in my opinion, because it leaves some residue. However, you can see the concept and how fast the absorbent would work. You also could then pull it up and any residue that's left, you could continue to dig out just like you were digging prior to the water being there. So that shouldn't be a problem, but you could go with a less permeable membrane to hold the absorbent while you lower it into the water. However, once it's solid, you'll be able to pull it up or dig it out just as you would a normal well. Water is heavy, so keep in mind the weight that your equipment can pull or lift when you consider how much you're going to be pulling out per scoop, per lift, or per containment. Of course, you could just drop the absorbent into the well, allow it to solidify, and then dig it out. So this is just another idea on how to remove water from a well if you don't have vacuum and you need to get it out.